Hi everyone, this is Lee Jones and I am going to do a paint pour. Um, I'm going to try to do a Dutch pour actually. I have not been very successful. I tried one the other day. This was the results. Um, I've tried a couple of the other ones. Too, and I just end up being so disappointed. There's Dolly in the background. So I'm hoping that today I'm prepared. So uh, to be successful, I have a new uh, blow dryer. That's what the first one was blown with. Blown with. I have um, some colors here. I have the white canvas that's prepared. See the canvas is how big? It's nine. Um, it's 12 by 14, I think. Um, so I've got this berry from uh, Deco Art Americana, and I've got 24 karat gold. There's no uh, extreme sheen in here. This is 24 karat gold. Both of them have Floetrol too. This is uh, red and um, blue to make purple. And then this is a combination of different colors that came off the canvas. And uh, it's so beautiful, metallic. It's like, um, seems to me like a pewter. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead. I've got um, sea hooks underneath the canvas. I have uh, tape. Um, and let's hope that it's not so bright that you don't get to see any colors. I'm gonna shut off one of my lights if that's the case. We'll see what happens. We'll do half with the dark, I mean half with the light on and half without, and we'll see if I can give you guys some quality lighting here. All right, so let's start with that pewter color. These are one ounce cups I use. They have little lids. They're great for storing small amounts of paint because I have a hard time throwing anything away including an ounce or a half an ounce of paint. Okay, so there's just a little bit. Then I'm gonna do the pink. So I've been watching Canela Sirocco. I think that's how, her, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing your name incorrectly, but I um, have watched her do Dutch pours and uh, she's just amazing at it and she used to blow the white paint over the colors of paint and um, now she just pours out, I mean blows out the paint and doesn't put the white over it. And so that's what I've taken um, and did the same thing. Uh, I don't um, put the white over the top. I also don't go to the edge. Some One of her, com someone's comments um, made to her was, to not go all the way to the end because that's wasting paint that you're gonna blow off anyway. So she's um, made it go start a little bit on the inside of the canvas, and so I am too. Okay. So let's torch. torch, torch, torch. So far, it seems like you guys can see, you are able to see things. And, all right. Oh, I have paint all over my blow dryer already. I should have put saran wrap all over it. Okay, so we go upside down. We make sure we have enough, not quite under the chair. And put it on high, and it doesn't work.
Okay, first time I think I've ever been able to move the, the air. See, what I want to do is make it where it looks like it's flipped back and forth. And I think I've kind of did it in one spot. I think I need to blow this. I think I'll use the airbrush. So this will be the, like me trying to do it with my mouth. Just get it out there a little bit. on oxygen would not be I just don't think I have it in me with this bad air quality today too but I'm picking up cells I love this I sure hope it dries I'm not crazy about losing this yeah this gold just kind of fades out so even though I've got some beautiful cells here I just want the purple to kind of go a little bit farther out Maybe the pink can go a little bit farther out too. Just like that. Hey, maybe I've got my first my first Dutch pour that actually worked, huh? What do you think? My goodness. So are you able to see, let's see the color now. Is with oh I can see how we could destroy our colors. I don't know, so I'm gonna shut them off, shut it off again. Let's see, that's really difficult for me to know. Boy, are you seeing a mess of stuff behind me? Um. Okay, let's go ahead and torch it. But because it is my first one, so it was the blow dryer. Oh, my poor little 15-year-old blow dryer just could not keep up with the way things were going. Um, it was having the hardest time, and I could not figure out why. I could not get it to work. My, my cake decorating airbrush um, does a, a fairly decent job but not not what I wanted it to do not the way everyone else's looks so this this is kind of close closest I as um, I came to as I said, making it look like it's going back and forth. to eat. Okay, so I'm going to bring you down, get you a closer look, see how we work. So this is my favorite spot right here. I'll see how it looks with both lights. My favorite spot because it has the edges that look like fun and there's a little cell action going. And yeah, the colors are a little... Oh, there's a bubble. Mm, I'm a little about it. There we go. And this is really pretty here. Even the colors are pretty in this corner. So... Maybe too much colors for this size canvas. That's what we have, guys.
Lee Jones's first happy Dutch pour. Um, or at least, let's take two. So if you're interested in seeing more of my paint pours, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified the next time I have a video um, uploaded. Thank you so much and have a great day.